Howdy, Summers. We have two new kits to check out today. We have the Cozy Bistro kit and the Riviera Retreat kit. And we usually have two kits released at the same time, but it's not often that both kits are build and buy kits. It's usually one build and buy kit and one create a sim kit, but this time they're both build and buy kits and I am super excited. So first up is the Riviera Retreat kit, which says alone at last. It's time to relax in a wicker lounge chair, watching a sunlight shines through the vine-covered pergola and sparkles in your private waterfall. Create the perfect secret spot for your sim to spend some quality time alone or with someone special. And natural charm. Set your comfortable linen furniture up among rustic decor and earthy features like stone pavers. This space is timeless, blending the fresh and clean with the natural to create a space where troubles melt away. So let's take a look at what we got with Riviera Retreat. Starting out with a styled room, we have the Backyard Riviera Retreat. And it looks like it comes in a few variants. I kind of want to see... I think I want to go with this one. So I will throw this back here and we can take a look at it. We have the new kind of stone pathing it looks like, and it looks like these are all one piece, but we'll get a closer look at everything here momentarily. We've got this new pergola, which I think is absolutely stunning. Pergola, pergola, I don't actually know how it's pronounced, but we have a new little fire pit, it looks like. This is really, really cute, I'm not gonna lie. Oh gosh, is this new fencing or is this just like base game landscaping stuff? I don't actually know. Let's go ahead and check it out. Alrighty, so we've got a new dining chair here. And I apologize for the lighting on this lot. This is not very good, but are any of us surprised? Probably not. It's really, really cute. I like the swatches on this. Love the pastels always. I'm so glad that they're incorporating pastels more. We have a new lounge chair, which looks like it matches the dining set. Super cool. Got the same colors. Absolutely love it. We have a sunbath soiree table, which also matches. So very, very good. I love getting new, like outdoor kind of furniture. So I'm super excited for this. We have this poolside towel station. Very nice, probably has all the same swatches. Yes, very matchy matchy. Looks like we have a new dining table as well. Just stick that over there. Maybe we'll pair the chair with it. And these are all of the swatches. Very, very nice. I don't know why. I'm really digging this yellow right now. Yellow is not even my favorite color, but I love it. On a silver platter drink tray. Okay. So I wonder if this works like the drink tray from the backyard stuff. I don't remember. <laughs> we have the bronze fire pit, which this is gorgeous. This might be my new favorite fire pit. I don't think we have anything kind of like this. We have some very basic ones from other packs, but this is stunning. We have the luxury lounger. So this is actually a pool floaty, it looks like, and this is gorgeous. <laughs> it's very simple, which I really like. I feel like we haven't gotten a pool floaty in a minute, so that's fun. We have a new plant, which stunning. Absolutely gorgeous. Looks like the pot color changes. What kind of plant is this? This planter is a harmonious fusion of nature's elegance and allure. Nestled within is a flourishing, what is that? Bergamo plant? I don't know. <laughs> um, we have some new curtains, which I'm not gonna throw up on a window, but stunning. <laughs> Love getting new curtains. Hopefully these fit properly on a normal sized window. We've got some new rocks, which I believe these work with pools. These are like the uh, waterfall rocks or something. We have an adequate fountain. Very, very nice. This is all very fancy. <laughs> we have the absolute masterpiece that is this pergola or pergola. I love love this i love the vines on some of these like we have some variants that have no vines but i think i love the ones that have vines on it this is so so pretty all right we have the new stepping stones so we can use this for our pathways and we've got some different variants on these actually which is really cool so there's a little bit of variety in there we have an embellished pool light so that will go on the actual pools. Very nice, lots of stunning colors. And 
Timeless tappers or tapers. I don't know. But I think this is a new light. Oh, yeah, it's a little candle. <laughs> That's really cute. I like that. So then if we build a pool, we'll just do something kind of simple like this. It looks like we have some new rocks with this as well, which is really cool. Oh, maybe these are actually the waterfall rocks. So maybe these are just regular rocks then. <laughs> so these probably place together pretty good. We do something like that and I guess maybe change the color would be nice. And then we also got a new pool ladder, which is really cool. So maybe we'll put that there and just kind of see what that does. I want to see the rocks in action, so... Look at that. That's stunning. Oh, I love that so much. <laughs> and we can see this fountain as well. Oh, this is so cool. I'm so excited to have more, like, pool kind of stuff. We put that in there and it probably floats around now, huh? Yeah, you can kind of see it moving a little bit. That's really cool. Honestly, this pack is probably like a 10 out of 10 in my book, which is a little ridiculous, but... I am here for it. I miss some stuff under Riviera Retreat, so <laughs> we're going back. But we've got this new archway. And super stunning. I love the stone kind of on it. Did we get new windows? No, no new windows. We did get some new wallpapers, though. So we have this Riviera wall tile. Ooh, interesting. I don't hate that, honestly. <laughs> And then we have this Riviera cobblestone, which is nice and simple. I really like it. Did we get new flooring though? We did get some new flooring, okay. We had this floor tile, which has got some interesting colors to it as well. I really like it. I think that's really cool. And I remembered I wanted to test if this actually worked and it looks like we can restock it. Nice, ooh, we can grab a drink. Okay, so that is functional. Yay, I, I'm really happy about that. <laughs> I don't know what he's drinking, though. I would guess lemonade, but those are really fancy cups for lemonade. So, I don't know. And our second kit is the Cozy Bistro Kit, which says, A neighborhood favorite. Craft a space that's all about good nectar and great company. Decorate with all the trappings of a treasured local bistro, including wood-paneled walls, polished metal accents, and vintage furniture that has been beautifully maintained. And nectar bar stories. Serve the finest nectar by night and the richest coffee by day. Fill your bistro with candlelight and classic decor to create the perfect spot for sims to connect with friends or dates. And we also have a styled room for this kit. This is our neighborhood bistro. I think I want to see just kind of the basic one. <laughs> this is very fancy. I really like this. I'm guessing this is a new picture because I don't think I've ever seen that before. But I recognize these other three pictures. It looks like there's a mirror in here. Excited to check that out. All right, and this looks like it has like new doors and windows maybe. We do have some new windows. Okay, I need to firstly draw a wall probably. So we have this window and this is the only one, but it's a full height on the small size. So very, very nice. It's got kind of the same swatches as the for rent stuff, I think. And then we have two new doors, it looks like. We have this one. Looks like it has a little logo on the door as well, at least on some of the swatches on like the windows. And then we have this open doorway, which is probably like an archway, I would guess. Love it. I love that they included an open version of that because that's really cool. All right, we did get a new wallpaper. Oh, I love this. This is super cute. If I could look at the swatches, please. <laughs> Very nice. I would honestly probably just use this in a house, not even for a bistro. Oh, that green, the green. <laughs> oh, I'm a huge fan of that. Okay. And I think we also got some new flooring. Yes, we did. Absolutely obsessed. Big, big fan. And then for the actual furniture, we have this new dining chair. Love the swatches on this, of course. We also have a kind of bar stool version of it with the same colors. And we have a new dining booth. Super duper nice. The Sims swatch game lately has been so good. Like, <laughs> there is not a single swatch on any of the stuff 
that I am like, eh. It's all so good. We've got this table here with a little cloth on it. And interesting that the cloth doesn't like fully fit over the table. <laughs> you can kind of see the uh, what underneath it. We have a new shelf, which this one is simple, but also kind of fancy with that little line there. Ooh, that one in the plain swatch is so good. I really like that. That's cool. All right, we have a some kind of bar back. <laughs> I don't know what the first word is, but we have this. So really nice. Could use this as like kind of a hutch in a dining room or a kitchen maybe. And probably the same with this piece, honestly. Although I think I preferred the smaller version of it. I have a pink one that could be really cute. <laughs> All right, and we have our bar because we totally needed another one, but also bistro coat. This is really cute, though. I really like this. <laughs> All right, and then we do have this picture, which I did see, and absolutely stunning. I love all these, like, old-timey kind of looking posters. <laughs> really, really nice. And then we have the new mirror, which stunning. I'm gonna move that over slightly. I love it. I like this little flower design that's on the mirror too. And it looks like it has some kind of door, maybe. It obviously doesn't open or anything, but it's implied that it can probably open because there's little like handles on it, I think. And we got some more curtains. Ooh, we got a smaller curtain. Nice. I love getting small curtains. I feel like we don't get them enough. Are the swatches good though? The swatches are okay. <laughs> They're a little bit on the fancy side, but that's fine. I will take a small curtain. Looks like we have a new awning as well. Some with logos, some that are just ordinary. This red one could be like really good if you were trying to build like a hotel or something. We have this notable nectar rack. So this hangs above the bar probably and holds all of the nectar. We have a bottle of nectar for some clutter. <laughs> could probably put a few of these around and Make your sim look very questionable. Oh, there's only one bottle swatch. Okay. We have the table for two menu. Nice little clutter item as well. Menu. Okay. Fun colors on that. It's all just words though. No like full on imagery or anything like some of our other things, but that's fine. We have a bistro sign. So this would go up on like Kind of the higher part of the walls, probably, like, right there or something. And... Very nice. Alright, we do have some new lights as well. We have this little lamp here. And it's got a few nice shades. Looks very metallic. <laughs> very shiny. And then we have some pendant lights. Well, we have a pendant light. Got the same metallic swatches. And then we have a little sconce here, which, what does this look like at night? How bright is this? Oh, it's okay. Yeah, not too bad on that. We have a new drip coffee maker. Where to put this? Probably on a counter, right? Like, yeah, it's over here. I, I don't have a counter to put this on, so we're just going to use the one that's inside here. But nice. I like the swatches on that. That's really cool. And then lastly, we have an intimate divider as a way to separate the tables, probably, or... I don't know. But that's pretty cool, honestly. <laughs> Everything looks so nice and fancy. I really, really like it. If I had to rate this pack, I would probably give it, like, maybe an 8 out of 10. It has some really nice things. So, I kind of want to build some kind of, like, restaurant now or something with these. I don't know. Something super fancy. Overall, I think that both kits are really, really cute. If I had to pick a favorite between the two, I would probably go with the Riviera Retreat Kit. Both are absolutely stunning, and I'm definitely going to be using stuff from both of the kits a lot. But I just really am excited to get more, like, outdoorsy and, like, pool kind of stuff because I feel like we don't get it very often, and it's been a little while since we've gotten anything, especially for pools. But I am super hyped. But let me know what you guys think of the new kits in the comments. Which one is your favorite? Are you getting both of them if you haven't already gotten them? Or are you just getting like one or the other? And let me know if you have like a specific 
object from the kits that you like. I think my favorite one from the Bistro kit is probably that mirror. And for Riviera Retreat, it's probably going to have to be that new pergola. Pergola. It's just so good. So good. But... <laughs> Let me know all the things, and with that, I'm gonna go. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel, and make sure you have notifications on so you don't miss anything. Be sure to follow my socials, links are below. I'll see y'all soon. Bye.